Um, I grew up on Fogo Island, um, and it felt like at the time that people went to university to be a teacher or a nurse. It kind of was accidental, a, a beautiful accidental <laughs> experience, actually. I had some experience um, home with the public health nurses, um, one of them being, and, and the hospital nurses, Christina Coles. She was a nurse that came over from, I think it was England, and used to nurse home. And my mother and my family always kind of put her on a pedestal. So the nurses were very, uh, you know, put on pedestals around the bay. I'm Tina Edwards. I'm a community health nurse out of CBS. So my favorite thing about being a community health nurse is you see people in their home environment. You kind of take care of the whole family most of the time, especially when you're dealing with people who have chronic conditions or illness and their life is impacted. You're not only taking care of them, you're taking care of the family. Lovely here in Newfoundland, uh, people think that everyone's family, so you have that community connection. I love that. That's my favorite part, is just being there for them and the family. I have people call me I haven't seen in 15, 20 years, say, hi, you know, uh, my family member just had surgery, can you help us out? So I find being that community connection is a huge part of our role, and I, and I love that. I'm proud to be a nurse because I think that we give back so much, believe it or not. Like, you get so much more out of it as a nurse than what the clients get out of it. Uh, being there for people, you know, from birth right till the end of life. What a beautiful experience to be the last person to take care of the person, their last remaining hours on earth to be able to have them uh, be comforted, uh, be pain free, to be the person to soothe the family, say, you know what, this is okay, and I'm here with you, to give them that guidance. They're, I can't even begin to tell you the sense of satisfaction and, and accomplishment I feel when the family say to me, thank you so much for helping us navigate through all that. Because it's the most tumultuous time in their life. They're, they're, you know, a loved one is passing and it's not always expected in regards of, it could be a cancer diagnosis that happen relatively quick, but being that person. And also to see people heal and become better and, and learn to live with the chronic illness and just being there for the community. My hope for nursing, be it because of my community health background, I love to see people who are able to, to be at home safely, to have enough uh, staff to be able to service them, to keep them there safely. Hi, I'm Tina Edwards, and I'm a registered nurse.